Okay, friends, let's hit you with this week's Foodie Fix. And uh, yeah, what does Rick Ross, Pizza, and our ISF correspondent, Miriam Tapia, have in common? <laughs> I will let her tell you. Take a look. Jeremiah, thank you so much for inviting us to Square Pie. Yeah. I'm excited to be here. Um, tell me your trajectory, right? Your career trajectory, because you, your resume is extensive. It's extensive. It's impressive. Tell me more about your career. I've cooked in a lot of different places. Um, I guess the the best way to say it is I've, I've cooked for hip hop, you know, royalty. Rick Ross, which is hip hop royalty. You were his head chef for a while. How was that? Yeah. Shout out to the boss. Mm -hmm. um, super cool. I mean. Just talk about like class, and we were fortunate enough to, to link with the boss early on and just kind of see him just skyrocket and just become, you know, the Don that everybody knows today. Um, always liked to eat well, always treated everyone well. Um, just like a mentor to, to sort of like look up to in, in many aspects. Similar, that's you, you know, like you were his head chef, then you did Time Out you know, market here in Miami, and now you have your own brick and mortar. Tell me more about Square Pie and how it all got developed. Sure, so Square Pie City started as a, as a pipe dream. We developed the, um, the pizza recipe. We were doing pizza Fridays for the kids. So every Friday I would fire off like four or five pizzas. Before I could ever sit down to even try a pizza, the kids would crush. So we knew we were on the right track. We had something that was tasty. Um, had the uh, opportunity to pop up at a friend's spot in Wynwood, and we tried out the Detroit style. I knew immediately we were on to, to a successful formula. It was just, it was easier to do larger volumes and super high quality. Mm. Did you ever try Chicago style, deep dish, you know, even that New York style? No, Chicago you need a nap, you know. <laughs> um, people often um, misconstrue uh, Chicago deep dish for, for what we do. Yeah. Although it is cooked in a deep dish, it is called pan pizza and it's more of a focaccia. We take the best of New York square pizza, even Roman style al taglio, very light airy dough. And then we incorporate little touches, little techniques from, from the Detroit style. Tell me more about the menu. Yeah. So being a pizza shop, we've got to offer a little bit of everything for everyone. Mm -hmm. um, we even offer in the vegan option, so we make our own cheese in-house. We've got gluten-free crust for those who can't oh, enjoy. Nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we try to make sure we cover the board there. And as far as our pizzas that we build, um, we just came up with these seven classics that just hit each category. It's just about making people happy. If you come in here and you say, I just want a well-done you know, pie, extra cheese, you got it. Mm -hmm. that, that's what we do, we're a pizzeria.